Sorry for my loud PS5 here. It's been on pretty much all day. Been recording non-stop. Anyways, the Warframe page is finally back up. You can finally go on Warframe now. I mean, I was going to put this in the video that I recorded for the Core Prime accessories. And some stuff happened. I had to re-record it because of missing information and missing things in the video. Not only that, but... I had a fashion frame video up on my second channel and I had to take that down because of the low quality, the frames per second had a lot of, a lot of problems with it. So I have to re-upload that, that's coming back. Um, so if you did see it and you're watching this video right now, that's why I took it down. Anyways, Core Prime is now available as you know of today. All right, ten, today was Tenocon 2022 celebration and everything that's about to happen. Now we have the Korra Prime Warframe here. The Venari Prime um, Kavat, really dangerous fangs and claws we have here for the Venari's um, Kavat. The Hystrix Prime, the Dual Prime carries, all great weapons, which we'll be taking a look at very, very soon. But the Prime Necessity is the biggest thing that we're going to be taking a look at. And, um, yeah, all right, the Karata Prime Cyandana, the Core Prime Larkum Helmet, the Internal Alpha Prime Narta. This is the reason why I had to record everything, because Digital Streams did do something I did not expect them to do. Now they have been doing it, I guess, ever since, like... The Twitch job 2.0, but that was honestly way before. It's kind of like a new thing they started doing, and they just started sending you stuff in your inbox. So I did not know what the Narta was at the time until I figured out that it is what it is. You're going to see in this video. Looking at the Prime accessories first, we're going to be looking at the Cora Prime Larkrum helmet. I don't even know how to say that. But it does look something like the Daviri. It does some does look something like the Corpus Tech. This does look like something from somewhere around that. Cause the shape of the helmet does give me a, a Daviri vibe. Uh something that obviously probably is what pushed back Cora Prime because everything that they wanted to put on Cora or continue to push Cora, um, they probably just haven't found the right vibe yet. To give Core Prime to you. So, in all of us, basically. Not even just you, it's all of us. So, the helmet is not bad. You know, it's not really that bad how I thought it was. Um, Yeah, I mean, we're just going to color it. Upon just looking at colors, I mean, you know, you just got to find the one that fits you, that, you know, resonates with you. Um... And I found a color that actually resonates with this helmet. It's actually really crazy. And it goes with a great sign. Donna, which you guys will be seeing, actually. You probably are seeing it now um, at the Fashion Frame channel. So if you haven't subscribed to the Fashion Frame channel, the link is in the description below. But, yeah, everything's not looking too bad with this. So the helmet, again... Not bad. Then we have the Prime Cyandana, the Karata Prime Cyandana. I'm guessing that's what it's called. Um, it looks actually amazing. It's it's not attached. If you see that purple attachment there, I, that's not part of the attachment. It's actually part of Korra. So, um, but there is a purple lining down both sides of the Prime Cyandana. That's part of its attachment but not the long thing that you see just dangling there it's actually part of Korra which makes it even just crazy about this whole design of Korra Prime the Prime skin obviously way better than all the other skins without a doubt they put her together all right she looks like something from you know Egyptian type flow to her design they just gave it that way um, that's what I see, especially the original helmet that you obviously saw. Definitely gives it that vibe. Um, so, what else more can I say about it? Now, coloring this Cyandana, not bad. It's just like every regular Prime Cyandana with gold pieces, always going to be one of the top priorities, I would say, 
definitely just being thrown on there with the pieces on there it just makes it more um makes it more eye looking something more to look at than just the rest of the design but however it's always about everything that goes on the sign down there especially when it comes down to a warframe you want something that pops so it's always just the like the gold pieces like something like gold i would definitely just keep on there it's just it, it makes it what looks good most of the time you know i i in my you know perspective i really think so now it might be different for you which is great everybody's gonna have their different opinions to whatever it is i honestly would say i i just gotta give it that now there are some colors that look really great on it but it, it's just always up to you you gotta figure out what's look good to you so the cyandana not bad at all pretty great looks good on Korra. maybe on other warframes as well it's got a really long you know it, it thing it, it kind of drops to the floor basically is what i'm about to say um and honestly i don't mind that i like cyan donna's kind of like that you know if it doesn't give it that approach then honestly i don't want the cyan donna it's most of the time it depends on how it's designed how it looks how can it um how can it look on different warframes that's what you're looking for as well in the cyan donna when it comes down to these prime ones, they just don't look right most of the time. But this one definitely looks good. Now, here's the hardest part about this prime accessories, though. It's, is it worth it? No. I gotta say, it's not worth it at all. Now, obviously, like I said, opinions are for accepting opinions. Or, you know, you can obviously not accept my opinion i really just don't care i always give my opinions on every prime accessories that's what the whole part of me reviewing the prime accessories to give my opinions my thought before you buy it this is not worth it at all the cyan donna is just absolutely crazy i love it i honestly upon just looking at it i love it i love it however they threw a helmet in here and called it a day it's just like come on really just a helmet too like what like nah man i just can't i can't buy by that man like that's just whack to me that's lame i don't like the fact that you're throwing a helmet in here and just that's it because i couldn't just easy not wear the helmet However, through Prime, like, armor sets or uh, ephemera, those are something I can wear daily, like, depending on how good it looks. But the helmet, it's not even that fascinating to me that I just have to wear a single helmet that can I cannot put on any other Warframe. By the way, to mention that, you cannot put this on any other Warframe but Korra. That's what I cannot accept by this. And I know I'm getting loud. I don't want to get... <laughs> I didn't mean to get loud. But you got to look at the truth behind this. They only made a Prime Accessories helmet for Korra and not any other Warframe. And obviously the last thing we talked about, if you go to your gear, you know the icon that it looks like up top. Emotes. And there it is. The Inter Alpha Prime Narta. This is what it does. And that's the emote. Like every emote you see in game. Um... Well, how come it didn't do that one? Okay, it did. But yeah, this is the Inter Alpha Prime Narta. And, or am I saying that? Inner, in, in, you know what? We're just gonna move on. That's basically what it is. Honestly, that is a waste, waste of accessories. Like, did you stream really? Now, I know you heard me ramble on about the um helmet all right but i had to you know skip to the next part because of this this waste of accessories in here for a whole emote not only the helmet but now the emote digestion come on man like y'all wasting our time with these like you do realize this costs money that we're putting into for prime accessories that I think you guys should take very serious when you do this stuff. Somebody could somebody could easily just purchase this. Alright, in the market or something. Don't waste it in a prime accessories. You're wasting 
you're wasting value that could be put in a prime accessories. This is valuable. You know, like I I hope you guys agree with me on this. Like I don't mean to be a a-hole, whatever you see in me because I'm reviewing this. I'm giving you my opinion on this. I don't like it because I put money into this and I want to see something real, something nice. The Cyandanas, the armor sets, like a helmet that's only for one person, a Narta that's for everybody, but what use do I have to it? Like, that's all I'm going to say. I'm not going to ramble on too long. I, the, the helmet thing was too long. I'm not going to ramble on. So I'm just going to move on. Again, you guys let me know in the comments below what you think about this. And that is all for this video. If you guys did enjoy it, make sure you leave a like. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Follow me on all social medias and Twitch. Links are in the description. Thank you so much for watching. Love you guys. And I'll see you in the next video.